Welcome back students. In this video, I'm going to talk about Trans Earth plugin for QGIS. Con Conservation International in partnership with Lund University, NASA and with the support of the Global Environmental Facility produce a decision support tool for as to support Sustainable Development Goal 15.3.5, one uh, reporting called Trend Earth. Trend Earth operates as a free plugin to the open source QGIS software. Trend Earth can be used to plot time series of key specially explicit indicators of land change, including land degradation and land improvement, and to produce maps and other graphics that can support monitoring and project implementation to address land degradation. The tool can also potentially be used to overlay other relevant and specially explicit indicators. Trend Earth allows to monitor land condition, including identification of degraded lands, can set uh, baselines and track progress over land degradation or improvement, uh, could use best global data sets, allows use of best available local information. It could be also used to compute land cover changes, to evaluate changes in soil carbon, carbon or uh, land productivity or vegetation productivity. Though you could use trend earth to monitor land condition, trend earth was primarily developed to compute all three components of Sustainable Development Goal Indicator 15.3.1 that follows good practice guidance developed by United Nations Com uh, Conven Convention to Combat Desertification. In order to assess the SDG indicator 15.3.1 proportion of land that is degraded over a total area, uses, uh, the trend earth uses information from three sub-indicators, land productivity, land cover, and soil organic carbon. Deriving the indicator for the baseline and subsequent monitoring years is done by summing all those areas where any changes in the sub-indicators are considered negative or stable when degraded in the baseline or previous monitoring year. This involves the assessment and evaluation of net primary productivity, land cover change, or soil organic carbon. Trend Earth allows the users to compute each of these sub-indicators in a specially explicit way, generating raster maps which are then integrated into a final SDG 15.3.1 indicator map and produces a table result reporting areas potentially improving and degraded for the area of analysis. 